It is so gross outside. Today is a blah day. I already know it. Ready, wash how satisfying. Ready, ready? Oh. <laughs> Good morning, happy, I don't know what day for you. Tuesday, possibly? I would say good morning, but uh, it's, hold on, let me, turn, let me turn this off. There we go, hello. Um, I would say good morning, but it is 1.45. I woke up at 10.30 and then I just stayed in bed because I've just, I it, it, it hit me that today is the last day that I'm going to not have a lot on my plate. For a month at least. Because tomorrow, tomorrow's whenever I start accepting new custom orders. Which by the time you're watching this, they're probably already sold out. So, like I said, if you ever want to catch up and keep up with everything day to day, it's on my Instagram stories. So, I'll be talking about that today. But, obviously, when you watch this, today is gone. <laughs> So today is gonna mainly just be, I'm gonna do a few wooden letters. I have to run to the grocery store real quick because I realized that, cause I made lunch, I made dinner last night and I realized that there's like nothing really to make anymore in my studio. So I need to go get some uh, food for the studio. It's currently raining. It's very blah today. I'm not in a blah mood, so that's fine. I love, like I'm just, you know, I love rainy days, but they just make me really tired even though it's almost 2 p.m. So, but when I get to the studio and after I unload everything, I have an exciting Snapchat update that I'm gonna tell you guys about. I might be getting some money. Not crazy money, but still crazy. So, um, I'll, I'll let you know on that uh, after I unload the groceries. So, I'm gonna go to the grocery store now. Cool, okay, goodbye. <laughs> Hello, hello, hello. Hello, I'm at the studio now. So here's the deal. You see how messy this is? You see how messy that is? This is still up, it's messy over there. I think today is gonna be a cleaning day for sure. And I know I said I was gonna do the wooden letters today. I'm actually gonna do those tomorrow because I can't ship them out today. So, and I have time tomorrow. Like I've planned, I've planned during my day to do those wooden letters tomorrow. So I'm just gonna do them tomorrow because I really, really, really wanna clean my studio because like even over here, now that it's March, I'm, got, I'm not gonna be painting anymore probably until like next month. So I think that's the deal. I think I'm going to do custom orders every other month. And so then every other month I can play catch up and I can work on other things like my other projects projects and stuff like that. So I'm gonna be putting away all this stuff and getting ready for it to be good for whenever I start doing canvases again next month. I just need to clean over here, put my groceries away, you know? I think it's gonna be one of those days, one of those days. Because I would like to get home early because I wanna shower and then get to bed at a normal time. So that's the plan. So I'm just gonna listen to some music, do a little time lapse of me unloading my groceries before they uh, melt because I got some stuff that's supposed to go in the freezer. I think the kitchen's the first uh, thing I need to clean. Cause you see like, I hate that you can see all that stuff. I'm like, we don't even, like why is there cereal here? I don't, I don't even have milk. You know how old that cereal probably is? And it's just all those snacks in there, they're completely stale probably. I just need to clean here. Like this, this is from September. I'm never gonna drink that. So why is it on, like why is it out and about? Like I could just put it somewhere else that maybe I'll drink it later, but like I'm not gonna drink it now. You know, things like that. I just need to clean and then I'm still on the lookout for a new table because I, I, I keep telling my mom, I was like, I want to make this look like an actual kitchen, like a full on kitchen. So fingers crossed, we're still trying to figure it out. But I definitely, I don't like open cabinets. I don't, it looks it looks so cluttered over here and I hate it. And then as for over here, as for over here, I don't even know, like that cereal is is still probably good, but the thing is I don't eat it. It's, it was from like a trip that we took in like September and no one ate it. And so they were like, oh, just give it to Britta for the studio. What am I gonna? I mean, I sometimes just eat that like, you know, dry, but like barely. So, and I just need to clean out this. There's the most random things in here and you know. So I think, I think the first, the first place I'm gonna do is clean uh, the, the kitchen after I unload. I'm gonna do a little time lapse of me unloading <laughs> and I guess cleaning, I don't know. All right, 
I am finished, even though it may not look like, you know, because you can see all that, but it's all clean. Everything's wiped down. I got rid of everything up here. I'm gonna do something fun up here, but I just don't know what yet. And then I'd take that stuff home. But overall, first room is clean. So before I started cleaning this room and all the other rooms, I figured, let's just get into what you came for. <laughs> you didn't come for cleaning, you came for the Snapchat update, which is totally fine. But I do have an exciting one. Not as exciting as $22,000, but still pretty exciting. Okay, so just yesterday, I got another message from team snapchat on snapchat so i got the first message about a week ago and they said that they would get in contact me within a week or so so that makes sense but i got the message i would show you the screenshot but i there's like my information and stuff is in there so i'm not gonna show you that so pretty much it said i guess i can okay i can i can show you like a tad bit I'll show you right here. It, it says, your spotlight submission may have made you eligible for cash. Pending final checks, you may have earned $4,958. Literally just for one video that I posted on the Snapchat thing. No, it's not $22,000, but that is because that was just, I guess they only give you money for the first 24 hours. So however many views I got the first 24 hours, which was only like 100K or 200K or something. Now, and I don't know. It was it was not as obviously because like right now it's up to like 400k or so between like I said February 2nd and February 3rd that is what I get paid for I, so I guess the first 24 hours of me posting the video is what the four thousand nine hundred and fifty eight dollars came from and then it says like you have to be over 16. I'm almost 27. So I think, I think it's a real thing. I, I'm still not keeping up my, you know, hopes or anything, but you know, an extra almost like five grand is, is pretty cool. And I think what I want to do, I'm not gonna, I have an idea of what I want to do with the money, but I'm not going to tell you yet. I'm most likely not going to keep it because I want to gift it to someone. So, um, I'll let you know when I do that. I don't know exactly. Don't know exactly, but I'm pretty sure I want to gift it to someone or at least some of it. I don't want to keep all of it because I guess I can use it for my business and also I could give it to someone else. So um, that was the exciting, you know, little update about Snapchat. I don't know when I'll get the money. Well, it says you'll receive an email with instructions within the next three weeks. So within the next three weeks, I may be getting five grand in my PayPal. And I'm pretty sure they do it through PayPal. That's what I saw other people's, but it's a real thing. It's a real thing. I mean, I've posted about 20 different videos on Spotlight and only one has done well. So it's a very, it's a hit or miss. And I knew that one was gonna do well because it did well on, on TikTok, if that makes sense. Honestly, like post anything on Spotlight, anything that you think would, anything that you think would go viral on TikTok, post it on the, on the um, Spotlight. But make sure it doesn't say TikTok on the video because I don't know if that's like, my my video did not because I posted it outside of that. Yeah, it's a, it's a real thing, I'll let you know if I get the money, who knows, who knows? But um, that's exciting. So that was <laughs> the exciting part about this video. The rest of the video, I'm just cleaning. So if you want to stick around and watch me clean for the rest of the day, thanks for sticking around. If not, thanks for coming and seeing the Snapchat update. I'll give you another update if I ever actually get the money. But exciting, exciting, that's crazy. My birthday's in like two, oh my gosh, my birthday's in less than two weeks. So it's a little birthday gift, so thanks Snapchat. <laughs> Okay, so as of now, if you're leaving, thank you for watching. I hope you come back tomorrow at 10 o'clock in the morning. I post every day, every vlog, my daily life of running a business. Um, this this coming week is about to be nuts. Tomorrow, I like I said, I, I am accepting more custom orders. I'm probably getting my transfers next week, and I'm going to start making the, pol the crew necks. And I will probably finally showing what the design is and the release day and I mean I guess the release day is March 12th but like I'm excited I'm excited so this week's about to be crazy that's why I want to get everything clean before this week starts so um I hope you have a good day if you're leaving goodbye if you're staying let's go clean all right next room is this and this over here still haven't figured this out obviously it is the end of January I mean it is the end of February and I did not get to this so I will not begin this to this part of the wall probably for a few weeks but I can clean today so that's good so I have to just clean up and vacuum and shouldn't take that long and yes I I'm going to watch iCarly while cleaning because why not all right my
much, much better. Nothing too crazy. You know, I put some stuff away. That has to stay there anyway. But I vacuum and, you know, put the stuff up and all clean. Also over here is nice and clean. There wasn't really much to clean over here, but I just vacuumed and wiped down the table. Over here is clean. And now the, probably the more messier side of the studio is this and my office. So this is the next room I'm going to tackle. I'm gonna tackle just, most of this is like my mom's stuff and she has things where she needs them to be but like I can clean up like this and I can move the boxes and stuff like that so and then also I'm taking down all of the minion stuff just because it's been like almost a whole week <laughs> so I'm gonna take that down it's gonna look so bare whenever I take it down but it's fine oh I don't even have the large ladder but that's okay and then over here I'm planning on unboxing all of the sweatshirts and putting them on this these right here because I don't like these boxes so I just want to take everything off of those shelves and put all of that on there like fold it all nicely and everything so yeah, maybe but this is what I'm doing first and I'm gonna put iCarly on again I don't know I used to love iCarly and I still love iCarly but it's like you know I'm 20 I'm almost 27 but it's just like one of those shows that you just put on and don't really have to watch but it's nice background music <laughs> And just like that, we are all clean. I wiped down everything. And even though I didn't want to touch this desk because this is where my mom works. So I don't want to like mess with anything that she was doing. But I vacuumed. I took down all the minion things. And we're good to go. So next, next is this area. I don't even know what to call this area. But it's about to get real organized over here. <laughs> Alright, this is this is as clean as it'll get. So I broke down all the boxes and I'm going to recycle those tomorrow. But as for this section, it is so nice and clean. So I I did not realize that I was not going to have enough room for all my sweatshirts. So I added a little labels. See right here. Small, medium, large, extra large, and then 2x. And then um, these are all the leftover of those sizes, but I also have 3x and 4x. So my thoughts are to go to Ikea possibly tomorrow and get another shelf and then move this shelf put another one here and then have a little corner of sweatshirts but then the problem is where do we put all these things but I think we could figure out a way that like I can put it on here so since I'm not selling these or these we could definitely move these somewhere else that they don't need to be right here and like this is just a waste of space so I think I'll be able to move all this stuff over and then right next to this, I'll have another sweatshirt shelf over here. So like, cause I would like for, you know, every sweatshirt to be folded and on like nicely on a shelf. So that's the plan for that. And everything on this table is gonna have to go, but right now I just don't know where I'm gonna put it yet. But it looks so nice. So much better than all those boxes. That was terrible. So I'm gonna get these boxes out tomorrow. And then luckily, once I have another shelf, I'll be able to fold all of these and put them on the other shelf. So this is clean. All of this is clean, which is great. I'm gonna bring this. And now the last part of my studio is my office. And right now it is quite messy. And since tomorrow's Monday, I really don't wanna like come in here when it's all just stuff everywhere. So time to clean this room. So this is as good as this side's gonna get. Just, yeah, these things, I, I didn't feel like dealing with that, so clean. And as for this side, this is as good as it's gonna get. I didn't feel like cleaning that because it's already eight o'clock and I wanted to go home by now, but I have to go edit my vlog, but everything is vacuumed and clean. Uh, just ignore my cleaning hair. <laughs> um, so yeah, today was really good. I got everything that I wanted to get done, which was just cleaning. So I'm just, I'm, I'm excited to come in tomorrow to a clean studio for a new week and a new month. The fact that tomorrow is March, which is nuts. That means also I only have like 12 days left to do all of these sweatshirts, but hopefully, hopefully my transfers are coming in on Tuesday. They're supposed to ship tomorrow and they're supposed to like ship really, really fast. So either Tuesday or Wednesday. So I'm thinking probably, <laughs> 
This weekend is whenever I will just take the weekend off to just do all of these. So hopefully they work. Um, but as for now, like I said, it's eight o'clock. I'm just gonna edit my video here. Hopefully it won't take that long. So I really wanted to be home by now, but cleaning took a little bit longer than expected, but it was mainly all the crewnecks heat press area of my studio. I am gonna talk to my mom about possibly going to Ikea tomorrow. I'm gonna show her a picture of this and see what we feel about getting another. I don't want to put I don't want to put these in my closet because I don't want them to get like dusty in my closet or anything. I wanna I want to you know fold every single one because once they're done I'm gonna hang them up and then I'm gonna let them dry because I don't want them to like be folded up and whatnot. And then what we're gonna do is once they're done drying I'm going to just put them in a bag like one of my poly mailer bags but I'm not I'm not gonna seal it or anything in case someone gets two for some reason. I just want to uh, keep everything as organized as I possibly can in this little corner currently looking at it now so I don't know we'll see we'll see we'll see I'm just gonna edit and then go home so I guess I'll just say bye now because editing isn't that fun to watch so thank you for watching super stoked about <clears throat> excuse me super stoked about the snapchat update who knows I will let you know if I actually get that almost five grand for that one video that's crazy that's crazy I, I have to remember um, to upload something else tonight I don't know what I'll just find some like satisfying drawing video and hopefully that does well <laughs> I don't know so very excited about that thank you for spending the day with me um, I hope you had a good day sorry this video was not ex and you know entertaining it was just all cleaning so cool I'm excited for the next four this coming week. It's about to be crazy, but it's fine. I'm gonna, you know, just, I have to just remember to breathe this week and I'm gonna get up early tomorrow. So then I hopefully will go home early tomorrow and go to bed early. I want to, I also, I cannot wait for it to be nice out because I, I was planning, I was like, oh, it's gonna be 50 degrees this morning. And I was like, oh, I'm gonna go for a walk. No, it was raining like the entire day, which I probably could have still walked, but. I didn't, I didn't feel like it. I just stayed in bed, so it's fine. I can't wait for us to be nice out so I can call my personal trainer and be like, hey, can we please work out? I'm dying. Can we please work out? It's <laughs> gonna be a rough one, the first session I have with him again. Oh God. But um, anywho, thank you for spending my uh, Sunday with me. Hope you had a good day. I love you. You are loved and appreciated. So I hope you have a good day and I will see you tomorrow. Hope you come back. I'll see you tomorrow. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> this week's about to be nuts.